Today's topic is when you are you um are you delusionally optimistic and positive? Are you delusional with positivity and optimism? <laughs> and if you, if you are, what of it? Or do you even notice that this is something that you uh, are even participating in, engaging in? Uh, but before we go there, if you didn't already know, I have a relationships course I'm teaching on Saturday at 12 noon um, Texas time or 10 a.m. Pacific uh, standard time, California time. Hey, Amy. So I'm collaborating with this amazing guy. His name is Michael Stone. He created Neurodynamic Breathwork, which is a modality to access and release your um, old suppressed emotions, and it builds new neural pathways to really um, uh, to access your intuition, your your highest intelligence, um, your inner wisdom basically the multiverse within you. So I'm teaching a relationships course regarding uh, applying the principles of breath work. So neurodynamic breath work is um, a modality where you breathe and you follow and you kind of meditate and then you listen to a playlist of music and it kind of leads you into releasing a lot of stuff. But basically the principle of breath work is everything you need to live your most powerful life already exists within you. So what I'm teaching you is you can use that basic principle to transform your relationships. So any relationships you have in your life that you really desire to have a really meaningful, powerful one, I can teach you how to transform it in a very soul aligned, uh, soul expansive way that is important to you. So check it out. Go to breathworkonline.com. You can sign up for a free session. Um, after this, I'll send you a link for you to go sign on to get a free month subscription to um, get access to as many breathwork sessions as uh, you would like. And also, you will have access to my course, the Relationships course. So I'll be teaching this course every two weeks. So go check it out. It's going to be life-changing. Uh, right now, I'm also offering a money course. So if you're looking to transform your relationship with money in 28 days for $48 or $44, um, that is going on right now. And I am the queen of transforming my relationship with money. So I have so much to teach you, so much to share with you for you to really change the trajectory of your life forever when it comes to your relationship with money. Um, and then if you didn't already know, I am a life Sherpa. I am, I'm an expert mountaineer for the climb up the mountain. And this mountain represents your journey to accessing the multiverse within you, your inner divinity, your divine origin, your oneness, your connectedness, all that wonderful stuff that exists within you. You just may not know how to access it. So when you hire me as your life Sherpa, I will help you access all that wonderful goodness within you. Um, also, the other title I'm known by is a life coach. So you can work with me on a group weekly basis for $48 a month on Wednesdays at 8 p.m., 8 p.m., Texas Central Time, or you can meet with me on a one-on-one -on -one capacity. The one-on-one -on -one capacity is the fastest way to get transformation in the least amount of time, but it's also the most expensive. So whatever strikes your fancy. Okay, so the topic of hand is, do you exude delusional positivity and optimism? Hey, Barbara Punks, LA. So, so, the reason why I asked you is because I'm one of those people. I was one of those people. I was delusionally optimistic. And I thought that if I was always optimistic and always positive, then that was a really good thing. Except my positively my positivity and my optimism was so extreme that it was almost delusional or fantastical. Like it was in a realm of fantasy. <laughs> it lacked some groundedness and some clarity and some elbow grease. It was looking for a magical easy button. Hey, photos, Flavia, Lorento, uh, Laurentino. And, um, and so my question to you is what areas of your life 
or maybe it's all areas of your life because you are a person who is congruent and parallel in all areas of your life. Where or do you see yourself having delusional optimism and positivity to the point of fantasy and fantasy and delusional delusion okay so let me give you an example so I used to tell my mom yeah I'm gonna make millions of dollars I'm gonna make millions of dollars and I don't have any doubt hey Kim Johnson that over time I will make millions of dollars but I was so delusional that I would be like yeah the money's just gonna appear I'm just gonna call it into existence and you know if I really believe that and I said it over and over and over it probably could happen but I'm still in a different vibrational frequency <laughs> where I think that in order for me to become a millionaire is it's going to require some effort on my part some sort of daily action some sort of showing up some sort of selling a service a product to my clients um, some sort of exchange of energy it's not going to necessarily magically appear in my life and if it were I wouldn't find it very fulfilling like if I won the lottery ticket like it wouldn't be that fulfilling so so the example is I would kind of be in this world of delusion where I think there must be a magic answer out there there must be a magic solution there must be an easy button for stuff to just magically happen hey uh, 10 Paco 26 and um, and I was so upbeat so positive I was so fast to commit to a dream a goal and then I would have no idea what happened how it would happen and then I just thought it should magically happen somehow just because I said it <laughs> and yes you are powerful you do have the power of creation especially with your word at the same time I think it is um, hi Frankie I think it's also important for you to at the same time um, be grounded you know and think visually have clarity on your vision and your goals and what your future looks like and it could be completely realistic right like let's say one of my goal goals is to live in California on the West Coast while working my soul elevated life coaching practice slash enterprise um, slash empire full-time right so I can just say hey I hope it happens <laughs> I hope it happens or I can also say it is definitely one of my goals they're definitely one of my goals I would like that to happen and how and what would it look like like it wouldn't be like all of a sudden I no longer brush my teeth I no longer poop I no longer pee I no longer eat food like right that's like living in some sort of like world that does doesn't exist if I were to really realistically visualize it and envision it I would see that uh, I might be living on the west coast and land is smaller so I might be living in a smaller house than I'm living right now and um, I would be working and um, what's my strategy like what's my strategy to move to California did I put in my two weeks notice yet for my current job at my corporate office job like am I like what's my exit plan right like <laughs> it is important to kind of think about the details and think about okay like where am I at right now like how much does it how much money does it cost to live in California like how much does food cost how much does gas cost how much does living expenses cost um how much is life how much is health insurance maybe health insurance is a lot cheaper than it is in Texas like all these different things right so then when you have a really realistic picture of how much is going to cost what it's going to look like what how much money uh, would I earn from my full-time job working as a life Sherpa a life coach with my my soul elevated life coaching practice then I can see okay so if I, my goal hey Basub Sharma like if I'm looking to visualize this and make it a possibility and manifest it into existence then it is important to know the details it's important to know the money we're talking about here it's important to know okay so if I charge $44 for a money course I charge $48 for weekly group coaching sessions if I charge you know uh, $500 or $600 for like 
you know, like a six, uh, six week transformational deep work coaching, um, you know, fast transformation track. Like if, you know, how many people we're talking about here, how many sales, how many, like, what does it look like? You know, if I were to write a book, you know, how long would it take to write the book? And then how do I sell it? How do I promote it? How do I self publish it? Like, what does Kindle offer? What does Amazon offer? Like all that stuff, right? <laughs> if I'd like to offer courses, what platform is it going to be? Is it on Kajabi? Is it on like emailing prompts? Like, is it on um, some other platform? Like, I mean, I keep saying the world is your oyster and I, I don't even remember what the, the phrase is, like the story behind it or anything like that. But you totally like, you totally get to visualize and be really realistic about these wonderful dreams and goals you have. And you don't have to be delusional. You don't have to be like exuding like delusional positivity and like unrealistic, fantastical optimism. Like, no, you don't have to. You can be, you can be positive, you can be optimistic, and you can be kind of realistic. And you, it's important to know where you're at and to know where you're going and to visualize with clarity and realism about everyday life. And what would that kind of life look like? You know, like it would involve pooping, it would involve eating, it would involve earning money, it would involve paying rent or the mortgage payment, it would involve all of that. It would involve a crying kid, it would involve arguments or disagreements, hey Dr. Jason 206, like it involves all that. But see how like grounded and realistic it is? And still it's also at the same time a dream, and it's also at the same time a possibility and something to aim for, something to shoot for, something to reverse engineer into. Do you get what I'm saying here? Are you picking up what I'm putting down? That's it. That's all I have for you tonight. It is Ava's bedtime. We're, we're a little ahead of schedule, so that's good. So I send you love, light, profound clarity, infinite possibility to create the life you desire to live, one that is aligned with your soul's expansion and growth and purpose always. Always, 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 always. Love you lots. Sending you lots and lots and lots of love. Here's to you living a soul elevated life. Check out my website, soul, S-O-U-L, elevatedlife.com. I'll post a link for that free subscription with Michael Stone and Neurodynamic Breathwork in the comments. And um, I'll see you tomorrow.